Alright, what's going on guys? So, welcome to another video today. Actually, this is weird. I'm doing two videos in one day. What? But, anyway, I just want to get on here. And, uh, I just went on a huge rant on Instagram. If you haven't followed me, it's Storm Chaser Justin. We're going to take a look at it in just a second. But it's regarding the latest snowstorm. These numbers, by the way, I made a video about it earlier. I'm not really that confident in these, honestly. Uh, if this was centimeters, um, yeah, I'd definitely be confident in this. But this is inches, and I don't really feel confident with three to six inches. I feel like it'll end up being two to four inches. Um, maybe the one to two in, end up pushing this three to six inch down. This area gets turned into less than an inch. I don't even know anymore. The models are all over the place. From the latest European model showing a swath of 10 inches of snow from Hartford to Boston. From the newest GFS showing 3 inches in Hartford and 4 inches in Boston. To the National Weather Service saying 7 inches in Hartford, 10 inches in Boston. And all in between, the NAM model saying 2 inches in Hartford and 5 inches in Boston. It is a complete mess with this, and it's a fast-moving system. Faster than normal systems. So... I'm really not confident in these numbers. Probably by tomorrow I'll update this. Maybe I'll pro they'll probably be lower. I'm honestly, but yeah, this is just uh, to show you the rant. I'll go. Here's my uh, Instagram right here. It's uh, Storm Chaser Justin. If you want to follow me, um, here it is. Uh, my rant. Um, right here. I said, uh, just wanted to say something real quick. Every other storm that looks significant has underachieved. Why would the, why would it change with this storm tomorrow? I'm not saying it will underachieve. All I'm saying is this winter has been complete garbage, and Mother Nature is on a roll with giving out these crappy storms. This could, could, could be a good storm. But at the same time, it could also be a complete dud, just like the rest of the storms anyway, point made. Here's my forecast right here. You saw it already. These uh, may be too low, but after all the rest of the duds, I'm happy. Uh, after all the rest of the duds, be happy. I'm still forecasting these winter storms in quotes because these aren't winter storms. These are little Alberta clippers, but that they're just little clipper systems. Um, I may update these tomorrow. I may update update these totals, but I feel pretty good with this. Uh, with how it is, this is. But the new models, has, how I just, however, I just told you guys. Um. Has only showed two to four inches. Uh, anyway, thanks for reading. Have a good night. Um, so yeah, that was my rant I just went on. But then I continued going on to say this. Uh, this is the Europe. By the way, I'll just do a little nerd nerding out real quick. This is the European ensemble map, and everywhere you see the area you see in this uh, blue circle kind of area, that's a good. Uh, that has a high chance, over 50% probability, of receiving um, over 6 inches of snow. So you can see Hartford has like a 70-80% chance. Boston even has a 70-80% chance. But um, this is just an add-on to my last post I'm reading from here now. Um, there's still hope for a decent storm. This is the European Ensembles. Uh, shows a high chance, greater than 50%, of 6 plus inches across central Connecticut, eastern Massachusetts, and northern Rhode Island. There's still hope left. Pray, pray, pray. So, basically that's what I want to say. I guess we, just to make this a little longer, we'll show you the weather service. I think they're way overdone. But, uh, if I want to make it sound like it could be a big storm, I'll put it in centimeters just for you guys. But, I don't feel really that confident in that. I'll probably lower them to 2 to 4 tomorrow. But someone also posted on Twitter, and I thought it was uh, funny, it was Punsatani Phil, in the middle of this map that included wind chill warnings, winter weather advisories, winter storm warnings, wind chill advisories, winter storm watches, and all of the above. All wintry things. Put Punsatani Phil right in the middle for him being a complete freaking, being a complete failure um, with, this la with this latest round of Arctic air moving in. See, I went to storm watch zone effect. I'll show you guys this. This isn't really like a big weather video. It's just me about uh, more about me ranting. Uh, here's the expected: eight inches in uh, uh, Boston, seven inches in Hartford. Um, the high end would be ten inches in uh, Hartford, ten inches in Boston. So yeah, these have it really high up. The low end would be one to two inches across it. I'm thinking that's gonna be the high end. Maybe. Don't get me wrong, this still could be a decent storm. I don't think it will. 
if I am, yay, good for me. I want a good snowstorm, but I know it won't. En it will end up being complete dud. So, uh, think of these as like the expected snowfall. The high end being seven inches, and just take out this entire ten inch, eleven inch area. Think of this as the high end, and think of this as the expected snowfall. So, th yeah, basically think of that. So yeah, I'm gonna get out of here. I gotta upload this real quick. Um, so I, that was just my rant I made about this latest winter storm that won't probably be a winter storm. It'll be a complete dud. But if it is, you guys can go off on me on Instagram. I don't care. Here it is again. It is Storm Chaser Justin. If it does overachieve, probably won't. Uh, you guys can go off on me there. Also, stay tuned because I will be doing a lot of severe coverage tomorrow because there's a severe weather outbreak. I'll probably make another video after this anyway. So thanks for watching, guys, and uh, stay safe out there.